I studied belief was the most important. For me to believe is just water. I drink coffee, I drink hot tea, so what's a what with hot water? I started to use a hot water therapy. For a couple of years, I was proclaimed asymptomatic. The moment I started to take the hot water completely, I stopped taking medication, not because I don't like to take medication, but it is a way of belief that my body has been finding the uncertain. And anyway, based on that, when I was found asymptomatic, you can give me your email, I can send you the report of the medical committee, full body checkup. Till now, for nine years, me and my family, we live with the hot water therapy. So based on that, I wanted to share the world. But when I said it to share, a lot of questions, when, more especially when I reach like universities, the colleges to conduct the lectures, because people talk. People share the news, so they say, come on, you share the, what you have. But I'm not prepared. So it, I had to do study, personal study, till I did my PhD in alternative medicine. That's just a glimpse of that. And now I'll be going with the slides to explain to you why hot water, and why not just warm water. When we say hot, it's different to say warm or cold. So cold is the refrigerator water, and warm is the room temperature, and hot is between warm and boil, and boil is a boiling, but not, so I say boil water, cold water is a poison, simply, because, I mean, I don't, I mean, I can explain to you why cold water has side effects, so what has, even warm water is just constant, neutral, so I moved into hot water with a specific temperature, which we'll explain here, and I'm addicted to hot water, the reason everybody, we're made up of uh, the body and soul, whatever you give to your body, your soul starts to search for it. That's why you can become, I mean, addicted to smoking, addicted to whatever it is. So I'm addicted to hot water. And I hope that uh, all of you will become addicted to hot water. And uh, I really enjoy my hot water. So uh, actually, I enjoy. Hot, about 50 degrees Celsius or 122 Fahrenheit, or because you do not take a thermostat when you go to a coffee shop to get you hot coffee. Your body has its own way to check the temperature. You take your hot coffee by sip. You take your hot water, not by sip, you just fill your mouth without burning yourself. So that's it, hot water. I hope Gloria can help so, us about distributing hot water. So one, uh, yeah. 120, 125, which is the same temperature. So exactly. Like the, stone. Yes, exactly. Yes, it's like hot stone for the, yes, you're right. I, I like some of the quotes be, which reflect, uh, we correlate with the bodies, what we're talking about, about how water therapy. I believe what, what Thomas Edison, I mean, what he said, the doctor of the future will give no medicine, but will interest his patients in the care on, of the human frame in diet and in the cause and prevention of uh, disease. Uh, I enjoy about stopatic and uh, this is Virginia College of Stopati Medicine. Very interesting. Osteopathy medicine focuses on the whole person, the relationship of the bodies, nerves, and muscles, bones, and organs, and the body's innate ability to heal itself. That's what hot water. But we adhere the, about the hot water. The fields, we will reveal later on what are the fields, are the most abundant fuel of the human body with aptitude to restructure and maintain its PAMs. We reveal about what are those PAMs health for its own innate healing potential. That's from the hot water. Why? The PAMs here just abbreviated with physical, emotional, mental, and spiritual. And being a member of American Holistic Health Association, they believe that a human being, I mean, being healthy is, doesn't mean absence of a disease. It's being healthy physically, emotionally, mentally, and spiritually. And we will find, will reveal why hot water therapy is correlating, I mean, cor correlated with the PEMS aspect of life that everybody is running after. So it's not just about disease, not about, it's about the PEMS aspect of life. And the four essential elements here defined by water, oxygen, hydrogen, and energy. We will re re reveal later on why these four aspects. So the hot water therapy, uh, falls into various modalities. You have the external healing method and you have the internal healing method. You have the hydrothermal for, for the external hydrothermal therapy. Everybody know about the steam therapy. Hydrothermal massage therapy. And you have the hydrothermal towel therapy. For the internal healing method, you have the therapeutic methods of drinking, which is the most essential 
to provide the fuel for the body, drinking hot water, the next stretching method, the cataphat uh, uh, burning, uh, and you have the thermal air therapy. Uh, 